If you need to access some user data frequently in your app, it might be easier to add them to the user objects in Clerk than to query your database every time. And you can do so using the metadata in Clerk. So in this video, we're going to learn how to add custom data to the user object in Clerk. Primarily, there are three different types of metadata in Clerk, private, public, and unsafe. And the main differentiation between them is where you can actually read or write to them. For the private, you can only read and write from the backend, from the server API. The public one, you can read it on the client side, on the front end API, but you can only read and write on the server. And the unsafe, as the name, you can read and write both from front end and back end. Let's jump into an example inside of our app. So let's say that inside of our app, we wanted to access the Stripe customer ID for each user inside of our app. So let's go to the dashboard. And here I'm going to go to this specific user. And if I scroll down, I can see the metadata data section on the dashboard. So let's add a Stripe customer ID, and then let's just put in customer123 and save this. Now, let's see how we can access this inside of our application. Now, on the home page where we are showing the information from the currently logged in user, I want to create a variable here, Stripe customer ID, which is user, public metadata, and Stripe customer ID. And I just want to show that over here. So Let's just add as string here to make sure we don't get the TypeScript error. And if I go back to my application now, I can see Stripe customer ID that we added to our public metadata is now here. Now, the dashboard is not the only way to add such metadata. As I mentioned, you can go to the SDK and depending on what platform you're using, you can access the Clerk client and update the specific user that you have with the metadata that you want, whether it's unsafe, private, or public in our case. And that's how you can add custom data to your user object in Clerk using Clerk metadata.